What's going on, guys? Welcome back to episode 18 of Buy, Sell, Talk. Once again, very thankful to be here. And, cheers, uh, cheers. We're also very thankful to have uh, Blue Royal on as a sponsor. What do you mean by that? Oh, shit. Um, I'll follow. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, my boy, my boy. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. There you hey, go. Yes. Uh, big shout out to Blue Royal here. Uh, they're always transforming the conversation between te- tequila and rum. And today, we're here to start a new conversation about the sneaker space. Yes, sir. Ain't that right, guys? Before we yep. get into everything, uh, what's everybody wearing today? I'm to start. I know you uh, you whipped these out for this occasion. No, I really didn't. No. <laughs> the <Yannis. laughs> I got the goober stoopers on. The, yeah. the six-inch killies. Very, very on brand for the weather, too. Yeah, it's nasty out. Well, not today. Today is pretty good. So. Nah, it's pretty good. It's out. a brisk 50. Word. So, But I got the, got the constructs on. Get you, get you a pair of constructs. Very good. Heavy. Give you a light workout, but still good. Fuck you know? with it. Fuck with it. <laughs> what you got, Leo? Have on the <clears throat> MF Dooms. Ooh. Compliment the, my uh, MF Doom. Ooh, I didn't even notice that. That's, <laughs> That's a good one. That's a good also one. Also, compliment my NJ hat. Yeah. And then it'll also compliment my. Oh, you want to call the brand today, my boy? Brevamped. Brevent, shout cozy out cozy motherfucking lounge pants. Brevent, mm-hmm. I need one. Send that. I mean, please. She's doing a Yo, restock. Retweet, retweet. She's <laughs> doing a restock in uh, February for Valentine's Day. It's mm. perfect. Yeah. Need one my way, please. I so be- I believe she's doing more colorways too. Where can where can All we right. find there? Where can you find there? Um, it's gonna be brevamp dot com. We'll sh- we'll include her information here. Mm. And yeah, fuck with your girl. Yeah, perfect. Brian, what you got on? Today, uh, change it up a bit. Uh, Wearing the Margella Solomons. This is uh so TikTok core. Oh yeah, <laughs> really, really, honestly, this is very mood board core. Very on the nose for Stony? today's conversation. With this, oh yeah, with the stony pants. Well, hey, you can't yo. see, but keep that patch on them, man. Yeah. yeah, always, always getting the badge yeah. in. No, nah, but this is the first time I've uh, owned the. It's the first time in a while I've owned a black sneaker. So mm, I was geez. always against black sneakers, but not this time. You almost went full black on them. Almost, almost. Mm, type uh, shit. I was told that I look like I'm in the Air Force. I don't know what that means. Thurhan said that today. I I would believe he's talking about the um, branch of service for the military. No, I I know it. Yeah, I know that. I Maybe you thought know. you just looked like a fucking giant Air Force. Who knows? Anywho, what we getting into today? Shit, man, motherfucking. How we feeling? Typical, 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 typical shit. I mean, once again, another uh, another basketball um, player who has a signature shoe with Nike. Oh is God, disgruntled. Yes. Let's fucking get into with that. how they're Please. orchestrating his. See, I'm saying no. That's how. Oh, this how is, mad I feel about this. This is one that Dylan's really looking forward to, to be honest. Well, honestly, to to give you a nice little hot take and start you off, I believe any signature player who's not wearing their fucking sneakers on the court is already losing. What do you mean? He already wears sneakers. Nah, he doesn't. He he's been, man's been wearing Kobe's like the last no, like, no. Oh, He's been wearing peas. He's been wearing Kobe's <coughs> for the for the most part. <coughs> I think the last, last pair he last wore. Year. Last pair he wore. What are you talking about? Last year or are you talking about now? No, hell no. He's last been wearing pair, his uh, he's been wearing his PEs. Last pair he mm. wore was a PE inspired by a Kobe that he wore yeah. for that playoff game. Well, before yeah. anything, let's state who it is. Sir uh, Sir Booker. Sir Mr. Sir, Devin Booker. Mr. Devin Booker. <laughs> the book. Shout out my man Jason. The book? The book Jason. <laughs> right there. Number one in my heart. Yeah. Well, Devin Booker of the Phoenix Suns, obviously, is getting his uh Suns all the way. Twenty twenty four Nike shoe. And uh, hell yeah, he thinks that uh, Nike's been fumbling the whole release. Yeah, absolutely, hundred percent. I don't know what the, the fuck they doing. They're bullshitting. Well, I mean, I think now's the time to to really um, address this. I mean, I I think it's I think it's Nike basketball's moment, and I think if they don't do this right, they're not going to capitalize nah, on. Because if you think about it, Nike basketball has been trying to revamp within like the last five years, which is fucking insane. But the only thing that's really been pushing them is either what one. The new Kobe's have been coming out. Mm-hmm. Somewhat of a push with Jaw, and then I hold Shabazz that came out with it, and then you know it lingered a little bit, but Jaw's still, still up there. Um, LeBron's are just yeah. yeah. LeBron's are just that's that's done. KDs are done. 
Nah, KD's but good. but with the re-release of KD's, season. yeah, yeah, that's, yeah. That's I mean, we're we're getting re- re-retro, re-retro, yeah. We got the what? We got the Galaxies coming out. Galaxies mm-hmm. coming that's out. All Star Weekend. What is hard. it like one thirty retail, which isn't bad to be yeah, honest. I don't care. The Weatherman it's hard. KDs are coming out. What Weatherman KDs. Oh yeah, out. those two, right? And the Nerfs. The Nerfs got confirmed. Yeah. No packaging. They, yeah, they probably not gonna get the, the packaging. Right? Yeah, they didn't nah. say the packaging. They just, they just confirmed. Box, yeah. yeah, but now going back to deep book shit though, it's like, what was it? It was um, I felt like it gave a bad. T- I've read something that said it gave a bad taste into fans, especially in Phoenix, because it re- it released the first five hundred pairs. In like France, right? No, it released the orange pair right here. That was like the first ever release of the shoe, mm-hmm. and probably the only one. Yeah, the suede. Um, right? Five hundred pairs in uh. Miami for our Basel. Oh, really? That was yeah, our Basel? at Unknown. That, oh, yes, 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 uh, yes, yes. Makes yes. Sense. And yes, then, right. you know, me looking forward to this job, I'm one of those disgrunched fans wanting to pair, but Never like, I'm looking on eBay and my yeah. size is like running for three bands, but I'm not going to pay three bands for that shit. No, it's fucking right. insane. You know, I'm not going to lie to you. Um, the shoe's kind of grown on me because I really didn't like it at first. I didn't like the orange color. So way. I have always been a fan since the get. No. Well, I love that shoe. The only thing I don't like and maybe I don't know whose idea it was, but to start like trying to just throw on Jordan One colorways on the okay, shoes. yeah, I don't know about those. Like, what but is that's going why it's on? PEs though. No, no, I get it, but I feel like, oh man, let what the was that? let uh, the shoe breathe before you start like shattered? tweaking them. Shit. The shattered yeah, backboard one. Put it here, right here. Right here. Doing, it was, right here. Yeah, it was a shattered Sh- backboard. Ass. It was a fucking booty cheeks. Uh, one he did of the, a neon ninety five inspired one too. That was a uh, yeah. I think he did a cool gray. Uh, yeah. Oh, there's a lot of. Colorways that as we're saying that's this, we're gonna one. make sure we put it in the yeah yeah right here, you know. But I feel like you know what I mean. Like if you're gonna do something like that, at least have like at least two or three drops already done or lined up. You know what I mean? I think it was just him, like PE wise, wanting to gain more hype about it. But I think Nike's really nah, is yeah. fumbling in the bag because yeah. they were supposedly supposed to drop December. And now it's, it's February. Now mm-hmm. it's January. Well, when nah. this episode comes out, it's probably February. Yeah, mm-hmm. but it's like yo. But there is a tentative date, though. Yeah, I think it's like the when 17th. Is it? The 17th of February? I think so, yeah. Hopefully. All-Star Weekend. Yeah, yeah, All-Star Weekend, which is pretty on brand for, like, yeah. new signature uh, Nike basketball shoes that comes yeah. out. All-Star Weekend still excite you? Mm-hmm. Not as much as it used to? Mm-hmm. I could say this year, yes, because basketball has, the yeah, NBA has been going so stupid this year. The Shout out Adam Silver. For making that in tournament, <laughs> that the, shit is fire. The in season tournament, that shit is fire. No, because if you think about it, the last, the last time any team has played this competitively has been what since bubble time. No, nah, we're what bubble time like? was a whole different scenario of ball, but now everybody is balling, balling. Yeah, today's norm is like what triple digits, <laughs> bro. <laughs> to have two two different players score sixty plus it's points in a night. You never see that. No, I think it's playing. crazy because I don't know if people are just getting better at basketball. No, just no the game 2K. is changing. Yeah, the game is super changing. Life. Shout out to the NBA. What? What? They're playing 2K in real life. Oh, they are. They said switch shots, switch shots. Crazy. Everyone, yeah, everyone got a my player now, bro. <laughs> Everybody's buying that VC for plus <laughs> ninety nine overall. You know? <laughs> but yeah, Nike. Someone from Nike ever <laughs> stumbles on this when this episode comes out, drop that fucking shoe, please. I need that shoe. Send it on the pair. Especially that orange one. Oh my god, that orange one is sexy. Dylan will size you so they can send you a pair just in case. Eight and a half, please, 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 mm. please. Yeah. Is that your true size in Nike basketball as well? Oh no, I changed like it from it, time to time. Uh, it depends, but yeah. Kobe's I'm like a nine, right. mm. eight and a half in regular. In the the Mamba Curios. Speaking Mamba of Curios, eight and a half. Speaking of Kobe's, what do you guys think about Isaiah Thomas going ham on these uh, customizations and fakes of Kobe's? That are starting to pop out. That's why I don't play in NBA no more. <laughs> Wait, no, but but was did he say that after the whole PJ Tucker thing where he wore that off white? I don't know. Clothing? I don't know the timeline, but I know like I've seen a shit ton of like, oh, somebody. Wait, wait, wait. Is it Isaiah Thomas or is it Jalen Brown? No, Isaiah Thomas. Oh, Isaiah Thomas. Yeah, Isaiah Thomas said it. And because said, Jalen Brown, he's the one that wore them. But he, he took off. Isn't Jalen Brown the one that took off the the? He covers it up with Nike. Well, he covers yeah, up the Nike swoosh. Yeah, they they painted with the, the Nike. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah now nah, yeah. He was. I don't know if he's talking to him, but he's like you know the fucking the off white Kobe's of the world and all. Ah, uh, yeah. Because yeah, yeah, I know yeah, PJ yeah. Tucker recently PJ won Tucker one. Did that, yeah, right? yeah. So yeah. fucking, he was trying to say how he was like day one like a fucking uh-huh. Kobe 
team Kobe player, whatever the fuck, uh-huh. like a Jordan brand player, but for Kobe. Yeah. And he was like, oh, I could spot them shits a mile away. This shit is carny. Like this shit um, is dead. ass. Blah blah blah. Like if you can't if you can't get them, like just wear something else. Blah blah blah. Like. Well, I mean that's. But that's I, the only thing that I didn't understand is that he started saying stuff like, oh, like people will sell you stuff and then say you can't return them and it be your homies. Like who the fuck is he talking about? Yeah, that sounded more personal. Yeah, yeah. like that shit sounded yeah. like. Sounded like he's coming at his boy. That yeah. shit sounded like. <laughs> that shit sounded like a reseller got wrong. He got, he got, he got crazy. He got burned boy. by his own boy. Yeah, nah, that's that exactly what it is. That's what that's it crazy. sounds like. Yeah, but, yeah. I don't know. Other than that, fucking um, uh, oddly enough, uh, Oregon, Oregon um, Duck team. The you know they do a shoe every year mm. for the players. This year they're doing Kobe's. Oh yeah. So they're doing no three Kobe's. Mm, that's yeah. sick. Nah, yeah. UConn got a Kobe too. You yeah. talking talking about all these teams? How we feel about uh, Howard mm. giving a PE to the basketball team? But well, the HBCU, right? I'm shout out Kai. The sixes or the ones? Well, all the sixes nah. came first, but now nah, they're nah, doing nah, the I'm one. Talking, I think yeah, they're doing the ones now. Yeah, yeah the one lows. But I think it was inspired. Yeah, by, by Sir Kai. Kai. Shout out, yeah. shout out, Kai. Sir shout out cool Kai, Kai. The first to do fucking it. Fucking running this shit up, and you know, now nuts. look at it. Fucking um, I believe he uh, he had found some like. Cause he did a he did a Letterman or a fucking like a varsity jacket huh. with him. He just gave the shit away. He's like, I don't even want this shit. That's crazy. That's wild. It's just literally the same. Obviously, it's the same color as yeah. color of the team. But like the fact that um this is what he's pissed about. Like Howard, like or Nike threw in the contract. Like you can no longer collaborate with Cool Guy. Like, that's that's in the fucking contract. Wait, that's in the contract. Yes, because according, according to Cool Kai, that's in the contract. He was like, "Yo, that's nuts." And they were fucking signed that. Because it's more of they're trying to take away Obvious. business from no, for a man sure. who's doing it big. Yeah, nah, that ass. They're doing. He's doing shit that Nike should have been doing. Nah, word. Now look at it. Now they're like, "Oh, they, they want this." Oh, oh, okay, yeah. cool. He's After like, seeing what he's done, he's taking a different route. And he it, paved and it's the way. Well, it's worked well for him. Nah, oh, word. Going back said, to what Ari said, it's, it's paving the way. Nah, you know? They said can't beat him. Let's try to take stuff away. That's how this industry works, and unfortunately, it's sad. But it's not even leveling the playing field. Kai, anymore. just keep it's doing crazy. your thing. It's all good. I already yeah. got. A, I already got a runner coming out. So yeah, that's yeah. it. I saw that. That's dope. Nah, word. I like that. Yeah, I saw a spec shoes like over sixty colorways. Jeez. So, <laughs> Damn. Good luck. Man, it's working. <laughs> yeah, man. Really good. Nah, Can I mean, you say? Fuck it. Fucking uh, in other news, um, Paris Fashion Week was a giant resurgency and um, different brands coming out and like popping out with new silhouettes or new collaborations or and people working with each other ways. once again. Yeah, yeah. 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 Shit's dope. Yeah. I think it's crazy. Um, nah, word. One of the craziest things to me is um, the Junior Watanabe and the mm. New Balance collab. Mm. The Loafer, the 1906. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. I think the crazy part about that is that I know that she hasn't come out yet, mm-hmm. but I've seen it on every Instagram mood board. And that's I feel like it's, it. it's already cooked. You know what that's called? It's <laughs> no. called marketing, Brian. No, no, I agree. I agree. No, no, no. It's called good marketing. Here's, here's the thing. I, I like the whole concept behind it. And maybe uh-huh. it's probably not. I'm probably not the target audience. And that's cool. Clearly. But I, <laughs> <laughs> well, here's the thing. No, no. But I think there's a bigger picture that we, we can't miss here. And it's that I think that these brands are also realizing that it's not just athletic footwear that is essentially this whole yeah. world that we're, we're in. Yeah, like it's more than that. Yeah, it's, it's. I they're, mean, they're even trying with- trying to go back to like what, the lifestyle? The lifestyle. Aspect of as, it. Yeah, I mean, even I mean, even last year and a little bit into this year, we have like, you know, bo- fucking um, Boston Burks, you know, like stuff like that, casual lifestyle stuff. Yeah. And then the Wallabies making a resurgence. You know, who the hell thought they were going to- Well, play? this is because Word. now there's a shift in- there's a whole shift in fashion. Oh, Word. <laughs> nah, I don't. I don't think it's a shift. I think it's like a motherfuckers is panicking. Not even that. I think wait, it's wait, more. Wait, wait, wait. No, not panicking. panicking. Panicking, as in like they're trying to like fucking pick up the the pieces of like everything sitting, yada yada. So it's like they're trying nah, to figure yeah, out. I don't, I don't think so. They're trying it to figure back, out like the next. This is not even. This is not even sneakers anymore. You're talking about nah. in the realm of actual like dressing up and yeah. putting shit on. It's because people now want more basic and minimalistic type of luxury instead of it's well I, I read something recently was called it's now everybody's shifting before covid there was a there was an occurrence of like minimalistic luxury simplistic luxury mm-hmm. yeah quiet luxury so yeah how like jerry's doing it with essentials the minimal tones no one wants the big logos no more and yeah. everyone wants to shift back to like taking a step back with like burks you know like yeah. wallabies loafers but 
as a person who wore loafers before, it's dope. But for my case, it's just like people's people's interests change because I, I you know, the only no, time I, I, I put agree. loafers now on is like if I'm going to go out like casual, yeah. not yeah, like yeah. like a like an actual event or something. But for me to casually wear loafers, but don't get me wrong though, there's people now. The AOD boys, you know, like all those dudes. Yeah, I wear loafers. Are, yeah, I know you do. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, how you feel about that? Guilty as charged, you know. And I, I got, I'm victim to this because I'm not gonna lie, I, it's a cool trend to hop on. It looks good. It's clean. Hey, trend is just more like it's it's dressing your age. I think so. Yeah, I think I'm at that age where I can't wear Jordans anymore. You know. Yeah. Teach um, his own though. You know? Nah, word. Not necessarily panicking. I would say more so like they're. Trying to like figure out new ways to to get the audience's ah, attention yeah, to innovate because yeah. it's like at the end of the day, like you know, not everyone's doing a new silhouette, new technology, mm-hmm. shit yeah. like that. So it's like let's just broaden the spectrum mm-hmm. and just give them like a bigger, wider variety. And well, you don't like this, try this. You don't like that, try exactly. This. Yeah. Where it's yeah. like you know, what I mean, throw a bigger net out. Hopefully, you get some fish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Instead of no fish. And I think you know, obviously, like that's meant to to do numbers on Instagram because, mm-hmm. like you said, it is marketing. Mm-hmm. But it also it, it's true to what Junior Watanabe does. I mean, like if you've mm-hmm. seen what they do in terms of like mainline and like all that stuff. I mean, it, it's a very niche. It's very niche, but yeah. it's very specific to what they do. So it yeah. makes oh, sense yeah, that they were like, let's use the elements of a, a New Balance and let's turn it into a loafer. It's dope because now you're tapping into the New Balance crowd. Yeah. yeah. No, because, I mean, they've done collabs before, but now introducing something like that is just completely different. Yeah, and I mean, New Balance. And for people that don't know how it looks like, it's right here. <laughs> shit, wild. No, there's no way they haven't seen that shit. That shit is nuts. Man, that shit's shit wild. Is everywhere. But yeah, got into that. I would say, like, the uh, the two highlights I have for, like, All Star, or, excuse me, for Paris Fashion <laughs> Week <laughs> is um, fucking the LV show. Oh. Um, That fucking. I like that. The uh, I, that shit the was fire. I know why you like fucking, it. Yeah, a fucking digi or da, what is it? Damo camo. Uh, yeah, I know what you're talking about. Fucking um, <clears throat> Damo, J- Damo camo. Damo. <laughs> this is Damo. Uh-huh. <laughs> Digital but, uh, camo. Yeah, digi camos. Uh, fucking sock, and he was out there with J tips. They fucking that was wild. They did I a think random ass. I think that, that looks better wild. than his first release. That shit nah, is word. wild. Yeah. My man's working like Soleil. Hey, man. He's out shit. <laughs> shit is doing. <laughs> you know I mean? Oh, surprisingly. So there's a... I just saw, I saw it today. Supposedly, Soleil, he's working with Louis on something. Doesn't really? surprise, yeah, surprise me. Yeah, it doesn't surprise, surprise me, me, but it's just it's crazy. Nah, I mean, word. he's worked with luxury brands before. Yeah, yeah, yeah he, like Versace. Yeah, and all yeah. That. But, still, but for him to input works into... With Versace. Yeah. You know, input in Louis is crazy. Nah, yeah. Um, Did you fucking... Did you notice that... Um. Pharrell just like became the creative director of fucking Human Made or some shit. Sick. Like out of nowhere. Should. You know what I mean? Like small little shit that you don't really like pay attention to. But I mean, like, him and Nigo have always been close friends. It's kind of you know. I, I'm, I'm not too time. surprised. I'm not yeah. too surprised. Yeah, it's about time. I wouldn't. I wouldn't be surprised if if LV does another collab with him, even Ooh. though he just did it with fucking Virgil or with Kenzo. Ooh. That'd be dope. We also have a Kenzo Asics on the way. Actually. Yeah, see, it's yeah, like yeah, a three yeah. pack. Yeah. yeah, yeah. See, and that's why it's good. We're back in the time now. It's like it relates back to sneakers. We're we're in the era now, like 2015, 2016. Shit's burnt out. Shit's cooked. You can get shit for the low. Everyone's give innovating. It, or everyone's give it another to. two, three years. Last dance time, and then that's when shit booms again. <laughs> nah, we're, it's it's a fucking history repeats itself. Fashion yeah. repeats itself. All this shit. Speak, but, speaking of cooking, I already hit up my mans to get those fucking Ama 95s. Mm, those are nice. I have no release date yet, but I do know I have them. Yeah. Oh, the fuck they come out. Lorenz, Lorenz, fucking... Lorenz vibes on that. The Lorenz OG? Yeah. yeah, he fucking, um, he, he did away with the, um, the lace loops, and then it's an all leather upper, so it's like different fucking, that shit's sick. different layers of leather instead of like the, uh-huh. that like gradient color yeah, yeah. you do. Yeah, shout out Lorenz G. Lorenzo G. Uh, you, nah, you know what's you know what's crazy too? Like I, I wasn't expecting a ninety five from Amma Manera, but it's very on brand for what Nike's doing. Cause or, I feel like right now it's good. there's so much and I and I'm enjoying that there's a lot of like I think they're gonna push the ninety five this year. I think really? so too, because they yeah. got they got gonna a rec- push it crazy. They got another stash coming out. If it, yeah, no, because if you think about it, every collab, especially with like an artist or a celebrity, has gotten a ninety five. No, 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 not even that. Like Travis with the Mac attack. Mm. Before that, it was the the fucking attack coming back out. Yeah. Before that, it was like 
So whatever collab comes out with that artist, mm-hmm. the actual retro yeah, comes out with it. Yeah. So I feel like ninety five is gonna be pushed like crazy this year. No, I don't, think, I don't think it's just ninety fives though. I think it's just straight Air Max. Oh no, yeah, because the TNs they obviously. need yeah, TNs they need to push this yeah. because now they they have to see like they saw how New Balance. I was talking about this with somebody a couple of days ago. Um, with the shit of how seeing with New Balance and Asics going crazy last year, they're just like ah oh, fuck okay. Like yeah. enough with the Jordans for a little bit. Like we got to tap back into what have we been doing as a brand? Like introducing the Romero again. That shit nah, was good. Yeah. The only, the only uh negative aspect I have on that so far, and I hate to be a negative Nancy, but that fucking union. Oh shit! Shit, ass. unions cooked. <laughs> Wait, what? The, the the union that like ground general. Yeah, the, the, the ground general. Yeah, that's what it's called. There's a that shoe. Is, they're doing the same thing with that. Where like um after oh, that union yeah, release, there's the, like a, the a shit ton of retros. But, but that's that, what they slated for 2024. Is yeah. ACG is going to be pushed again? A lot mm-hmm. of older retros. Humeras are, are really coming into the forefront. It's crazy. Yeah, uh, undefeated, undefeated has another Humera come. There's another like three two. or four colorways, right? Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. that like teal purple is fucking. What's that shit? The um the shit that just came out. The lunar something. Oh fuck. Oh that 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 runner I was telling you. I was like, yo, you like these? The, the foam? cream. The yeah. cream looking joint. The yeah, lunar foam the, with the teal the and the foam? yellow. Yeah. I grew on that. That shit's hard too. Yeah. I like those. Yeah. That's very like React esque. Nah, word. Like yeah. it's I, like on like, some like yeah. Mm-hmm. That's like early like React era. Like yeah. That's yeah. what that's what it's great it though. Me. See again. It looks cool. I mean, yeah. I, I think mean, Nike finally woke up and they're like, all right, cool. I think Jordan's burnt out right now. Nah. So let's tap back into like our fucking general. I mean. You can't really say that Nike's saying that Jordan's tapped out. It's two different no, brands. No, no, no. It's two different brands, yeah, but yeah, yeah. now they have to push that yeah, yeah. a little harder than they do oh, for of course. Because, I mean, yeah. the, the cool thing about Nike is that, like, they have such a fucking vault that, like, oh, yeah, any, the any, crazy. any type of, like, competitor, they can just switch to that fucking demographic and be like, all right, you want runners? I got runners. Yo, go to the vault. <laughs> go to the vault. <laughs> like, <laughs> Yeah, they're really, like, I don't think there's any sort of panic when it comes, because, like, yeah. when you think about Nike, Nike's a global brand, you know? Like, no, Nike yeah, isn't, sure. Nike isn't just catering to the U.S. market, and I feel like that's mm. why it was, it's it's such a good move to shift towards, like, the whole Air Max mm-hmm. um, agenda, because at the end of the day, like... Japan releases about to go crazy. That's what nah, I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. And it's, like, mm. that that's a silhouette that's been, like, recognized by everyone. Like, yeah. I grew up on the Air Max. Right. Like, that's a, that's a shoe that I've, like... Way before Jordan was a thing in my life, like I loved Air Maxes, mm-hmm. and even now, like that's something I love to gravitate towards. Like I was telling Leo, that purple and orange TN. Oh yeah, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that one. That shit's dope. That yeah. that's probably one of the best like yeah. general release well, Air Max uh, Plus yeah. colorways I've seen in a while. Yeah. So it's like. Oh, by the way, uh, to for earlier topics, remember when I told you about the ACW like that, like paint rolled shit yeah. mm-hmm. that was an old pair that's not oh really that's not a well, new that, that looks that was like his literal old pair that he gen- oh the he black gen- one the blue yeah. joint or the black one no no nah, so he posted were... a picture of a no. black pair that's like but it was like paint, paint rolled paint oh, for rolled yeah with like, no laces wow. that was like his like studio pair uh, like that he fucked with himself looks pretty cool cause it's, it's, it's I mean it has a story to tell nah yeah mm-hmm. I mean if you're hearing this people want to put it out fuck it yeah fuck hell yeah like HQ it's not bullshit. <laughs> um, fucking. Other than that, is there anything else that went crazy? Fucking Paris. Well, I mean, I wanted to talk about the Louis Vuitton thing because mm-hmm. obviously you mm-hmm. think they ended on a high note. What Louis? What with the whole Pharrell show and the lovers? I don't think. Sort of... I think it's just the best one he's done so far. I mean, I think it's all right. Nah, because you're introducing Western Western culture, American culture, and that fucking work jackets. Louis yeah. Vuitton work jackets. Yeah. I think it. I think, the fucking. I think the, it makes sense. The entire Tim collection. Dude, oh, that shit is. <laughs> Dude, you said that shit's ass. I know you're bullshit. That, that shit is ass. ass. I'm. I'm not even lying. All right, let's end this. Right no, here. no, 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 no. <laughs> no. But like, hear me out. And like, this is this. See, is, each his own though. No, no. Yeah. But but this is this is like a nod to what you said earlier. Like that's just the power of marketing. Yeah. Because put it like this. Mm. That shit. Shit like that used to exist on Canal Street. 10, 15 years ago. Mm-hmm. And I guarantee you, anyone who says that shit is hard now would have walked past that shit 10, 15 years ago on Canal Street and been like, nah, yeah. fuck that. I mean, you can't really make that argument when El- when uh, Virgil did the Air Force and everyone went Google Gaga over yeah. well, what do you Wait, 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 wait. wait. What do you mean? Like, in the, sa- a- in the same token, like, you know, 15 years ago, whatever the fuck, like, it was like fake Louis Vuitton Air Forces everywhere. It's like fucking dudes throwing he... Supreme on an Air Force but, on Canal Street. But that, yeah. that's yeah. my thing. Like it, 
I didn't like that shoe either. Like, oh, okay, okay. That, that's yeah. what I'm saying. Like, okay. I thought that Louis Vuitton shit was trash too because it's so uh-huh. tacky. Like, it's yeah. so like in well, your face. It, like, it's not marketing to you. So yeah. it's marketing to somebody else. Then right. that's why that somebody else is but, like someone like me. But what, what does that what does that mean? Like, do you get what I mean? Like, it are we only attracted to it because like this is an official collab, or do we only care because it's I don't, like no, no I, I don't know, no, I don't think it's so, just more I don't of like. like it. I've what never, like? I've never in my life put a, ter- a pair of Timberlands on, so I can, I can yeah. wholeheartedly tell you I don't like it. Nah, you know I like mean? it because it's more of, you know, Timberlands are made to get fucked up. Yeah. Right. Oh well, yeah. But for something like that, this is an upper echelon shoe now. Yeah. So then, where are you wearing this to? Because you can't wear it to the club. Casually, I'm casually wearing Timbs right now. <laughs> it's not raining. It's not snowing outside. I'm just casually. Like wearing I can, tims. I could appreciate it, but yeah. I just know for a fact it's not for me. But it also goes to show it's like you have to broaden your horizon, especially as a powerhouse like Louis. You're mm-hmm. just like, all right, we did Nike. What else? They never nah, yeah. did a Timberland. For sure. That's why it's fucking dope. It's just no, like, and I, I, I could say like I could true. appreciate it because it's just one more like not to say that Timberland is is a black owned market, but I just feel like it's a like a very like heavy black like culturized shoe like hip hop and oh, shit yeah. so it's like one more barrier that you know mm-hmm. somebody's breaking into that like luxury realm mm-hmm. where you know like and I don't think any high end luxury brand has ever collabed with Timberland like that I don't know man Brian's gonna have to He's gonna argue with you and tell, and tell you that ACW did it first oh uh, <laughs> I don't know that's, that's, that's new school that's new that's school, new yeah, school. Doesn't count. that's very yeah. new school I wouldn't count that. And that's they they made a new silhouette. This is taking an old classic. Silhouette. Oh yeah, it's just a six inch without mm. the laces. Exactly. Yeah. But they came yeah. out with the. Uh, I think they're doing the whole. They're doing fucking, like five different boots. They're doing a six inch. They're doing the well, whole. Well, what fucking, I like about that is that obviously they're paying. He's paying homage to the true cowboys of the West. Mm. Yeah. So a lot of these boots are actually like work boots, like cowboy boots, stuff yeah. that you would wear like on, on out on the range. And yeah. it's, it's it's cool. Type shit. I feel like that that part is cool. Yeah, what I don't like is how tacky it looks. It's it's also like well, that's why there's five different ones. Yeah, it's also true uh-huh. to like his like aesthetic. You know what I mean? Like he did the fucking big ass ten gallon hat back in the day. You know what I mean? Like <laughs> oh, so, you know what I mean? That's, I forgot that, about that. That's oh, literally ten, that ten gallon hat with the Adidas <laughs> sweatsuit. That's, that's literally his aesthetic. Like is like what old song was popular? Shit. Well, happy, happy. happy. Yeah. <laughs> happy. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, so he's happy, like, man. you know what I mean? So at the very least, he's on the nose with like what the fuck he likes. He's doing shit I mean? that he wants. Yeah, it's like which at, is why you... it's like at the end of the day, like it's it's on some shit. Like if you were the fucking you know creative director of menswear. That's like you would be doing wherever the fuck you want. You'd be doing a collab yeah, with no, Stone Island and like all these other yeah, shit. Yeah. You know what I mean? No, like, no, you're right. You're right. So it's. But I, I'm just. I don't know because it, it baffles me because it's like obviously we we talk a lot about this stuff coming around full circle mm-hmm. and really like just to see it play out firsthand when you're like, oh, you know, like that that shit is trash. Like 10, 15 years ago, you know, because it's not authentic or it's fake or it's like someone just wanted to do a custom, you know. Mm-hmm. And now we're all kind of like, you know, every internet. Every internet forum and every internet mood board is posting this, and you're like, "Yo, this shit is so hard." That's why it's fashion. Fashion changes. It just goes to show you, yeah. It's ever you changing. Gotta fucking, you gotta keep that up. pendulum. It fucking goes from the left to the right. Oh yeah, they never say you don't stays like that. Here's something else. No oh, word. But yeah, no. This this year is gonna be a great year for shoes. It's gonna be a great year for fashion. It's gonna be dope. Well, what are we expecting? Yeah. Um, if well, you were, to, if you were yeah. to really like try to tap in or tell into the, to like look into the future, what do you what do you think is gonna be on top by the end of this year i feel like grs i, I feel like grs are gonna are gonna come out Runners heavy again yeah yeah nah like because like it's just a for, start yeah also hot take um well do you guys know that um like the the pine green four the structure of that shoe is now how every four is gonna come out from now on really yeah. the same structure great so the same you know, yeah they, uh, as it should they like rework the toe box to make it a little bit wider yeah, yeah. so that way your pinky toes and fucking like all the screen. all that yeah, plastic yeah. is gonna be rubber and all types of shit oh for real yeah it's literally gonna be the same exact fucking structure of the pine green four all right so talking about the fours how we feel about the bread fours that we imagine i love them i fucking hate them fucking I'm, hate them there i'm on, go, I'm, so on agree I'm on my third pair i haven't even got them there you go fucking <laughs> um shit's ass yeah, you say that. That shit is hot. Garbage. If I see you with them shits on for at least two hours and then you but, trade them, but I know it was a shit. Mark that. Whatever Fucking time stamp this clip is. Clip that. Clip that. How about <laughs> how clip about that. this? Clip hot, that. Clip that. Hot take. I feel like Jordan Four is gonna jump over Jordan One this year. Oh, anything's jumping over Jordan Ones right now. Yeah, that shit. <laughs> what was that bullshit ass colorway that just came out like two weeks ago? Yellow ochre. Yeah, that shit. The six did better. Than I that. think that surprised. No, when was that? You were you were with me, right? It surprised me so crazy how. 
we no before release and she's oh, like yeah. a buck thirty. Yeah. I started. I was, I was like, like nah, there's no way. There's no. And way they upped the price on them. What is it? One eighty now? No, it was one eighty. It's like I, it might be one ninety if not two hundred. Fuck. Yeah. Oh, I think this year's gonna be the introduction of a lot of price hikes for Jordan. No, now, always. So. Yeah, yeah. yeah, they always do a what's fucking. That, what's that? What's that? Air Jordan Four retailing for the reimagined? No. What is that? The seventeens. I mean, the oh, it's three hundred. Yeah. yeah, is it three hundred or is it two fifty? Well, they charge two hundred. I think before, it's coming. Right? I think it's coming with the briefcase though. Two fifty, right? Yeah, three hundred. No, it's three hundred. No, it's three hundred. Three hundred. Yeah, it used to be two fifty. Back in the day, it was two fifty. I mean, respectfully, the elevens were three fifty or three thirty. The gratitude for the for the fucking that's for the pack though. What the was gratitude? The, oh. No, the fucking December. That shit was three thirty. Gratitude was not three thirty. That was two. That was two thirty. Two thirty. Yes, bro, nah. <laughs> I haven't fucking. <laughs> you hey, man, I haven't. I haven't <laughs> shopped. Yeah, that shows, I haven't shopped at a that shows, retail. That shows Jordan. Leo doesn't pay retail for anything. <laughs> you know what I mean, like, I don't know, say, Papi. Pay under retail. If it's not under, it's not for me. That's true. Two thirty was not. Even for two thirty though, two thirty is nuts. Nah, we like, especially when they restocked them like two days ago. God get damn, whacked yeah. <laughs> no what was uh no, cherry 12s are at 180 right? yeah they also dro- redropped those they did a jordan reserve it oh, was yeah, the yeah. neapolitan 11 the gratitudes and the cherry 12s yeah, yeah, yeah. so basically shit that's sat. yeah they were like yo we still got it here you go no dropping again they, they dropped it like a fun play i wouldn't i wouldn't again. be surprised i wouldn't be surprised if x dropped the whole like hey zero seller fees and that shit's two dollars now oh <laughs> my god yo the zero seller fee on the gratitude they know what they're doing though you nah, know what I mean? yo, they're that, fucking like, up that shit for everybody yeah, they're, they're, the trying, they're trying to they're trying to like be like not be the market but they're trying to like be the end all see all for the market mm-hmm. shit. um but if it ain't green button i don't want it on a side note um i feel like uh all-star weekend is gonna be heavy for nike and jordan and jordan again this year um yeah. they're gonna be doing a shit ton of releases both like both brands um i'm pretty sure i don't know if it's confirmed because it's any apolis and who the fuck goes there? But I don't know if they're gonna do like another event like they did in Chicago. Mm. But there's hella Yo. shit. There's hella shit coming out. Remember that? I remember that year when it, when All Star was in Chicago. Yeah. It was cold as shit. New beginnings yeah. pack. It was so cold that year. What it else came like, out? Yeezy Quantums. The fucking. Oh, I remember stupid for the Quantums. The, nah, it was the Yeezy basketball. He was yeah, giving yeah, it away. The the nah, but there's two different. Back then it was two. Oh different yeah, shoes. it was basketball. Yeah, it, it was Yeezy. It was the and basketball. The lifestyle, and then, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And then uh, fucking that, them shits that stupid ass fire red shy. Yeah, that was oh that my one. god, bro, that shit was stupid. <laughs> I see it right now. There's one right there. <laughs> what is it fire red cement? Fire yeah, red yeah. shy, yeah. and then shit. unite no, fire bro. red. Oh my yeah, god, yeah, yeah. Christ. But we'll Fuck see it. though. We'll um, see. Yeah, because it's supposed to be majority of the galaxy packs are coming out. I they still haven't confirmed the phone posit, but at the very least, the phone posits are going crazy. The again. KDs are coming mm-hmm. out for sure. Galaxy. Um, you know, weekend fucking, Again, exactly. or excuse me, All Star weekend. Um, the leather bread fours are coming out. I, the Devin Bookers are coming out. Exactly what it is. I want to say every other motherfucker basketball shoe is gonna come out. That it only makes Going sense. Back to how it was. It's, you know history what I mean? repeats so, itself. So I feel like All Star weekend is gonna be like it's gonna be great. It's gonna be about to host a party for All Star weekend. Yeah, hey, uh, I, I think that's a way to be yeah. dope. Rooftop at those. Yeah. I, <laughs> Yo, if you see this, the address is... <laughs> <laughs> nah, but I feel like All-Star Weekend is like that one weekend where Nike and Jordan dominate because yeah, no one else really shit. no one else really has... Not that no one else has a basketball shoe, but no one else is really like Adi- up there. Adidas on. is going to drop a new colorway of the AE1. Yeah, yo. I heard that shoes We really have good. one, too! <laughs> <laughs> they're gonna it. They're going to drop a fucking Fear of God basketball shoe. Nah, y'all, y'all be hating on those, but... I like oh, that I'm not, whole collection. I'm not hating. I'm just I'm just here telling jokes, bro. Nah. That shit's ass, bro. <laughs> that shit is that, <laughs> that shit is that, nice. that talcum powder shit we had the other day shit was ass. I'm sorry. Somebody hit me up for it. I was like, these? And just like Jerry just went back. I love Jerry, but Fuck. my man's just copy and pasted. He's like, Yeah, different brand, same shit. Nah, you're crazy. Nah. Don't no, nah, you can't say nah. he just copy paste because he didn't. He did not. No, nah, I mean he not didn't, but I, I'm talking I about still, like, the colorway. I still and, want that fucking I still want that Adelaide fucking fear of God. I feel like that shit is gonna be smooth as uh, like the slide. Yeah. Fuck that. Yeah, I need that. Just get the regular nah, ones. Nah, I need that, bro. That shit, like shit, that shit is like smooth as that. Bro, bro, go to I'm, you can get like forty dollars for the same fucking slide. Nah, I'm copping yeah, yeah, yeah. that outlet, bro. Come on, baby. Get that. Nah. 
<laughs> nah, I think look, I think Jerry I was need the right. That, bro. Like, yeah, you're right. You're right. He's like the same colorways, but that's Jerry's brand. No, nah, yeah, know? that's that's yeah. his forte. Like, you look at you look at mainline for your god, and that's you're, that's walking, you're looking at a run. But again, though, it it caters to a different crowd. Mm-hmm. The grown ups, you know, it does. I the mean, Jerry boys. I like where he got all that inspiration. From. Obviously, he did bring out mm-hmm. a lot from the archive. Mm-hmm. Eighty six mm-hmm. low. Yeah, that's one that we haven't seen in a while. Mm-hmm. We worked it thicker soul, and then what's that basketball shoe called? Mm. The one that's two tone. Yeah, that one. I forget the name of it. The, I don't uh, know. the I'll one, the one that we were like, oh, this is actually fire. I wouldn't pay for it, but this is fire. It's got like a prime knit upper. The one that looks like a Yeezy, a Yeezy Quantum, but it's not. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Let's talk about so it. that one. That one was all right. Yeah, I that like was that. what I liked good. about that one is that, and I don't know if you guys know this, but the design language for that, the three stripes, that's actually ripped from a Predator. I don't know if you know what the predator uh, the, is. The soccer shoe. The soccer thing. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. The fact that sorry, I play basketball. Yeah, well, like gives you homage type shit to that. Well, I I knew like that was a nod that 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 was included in the shoe, but I just think it means so much more for yeah. him to yeah. like rip that from the archive and be like oh, again shit, though. Like, that's why it goes back until this year. You're really gonna see brands go neck to neck. Nah, word. Nah, yeah. It's gonna go crazy. Like. Yeah. They're gonna be like, oh, you drop some hot shit, I'm gonna drop some hot shit. Hopefully, uh, Edison Chen does something else. Oh, yeah, I forgot he's been yeah. Adidas now. Yeah. yeah, now they're doing bowling shoes with brain dead. Oh, Get God. whacked. <laughs> Get super whacked. My brain is dead. Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe that's what we're, we're gonna be wearing in 2024. Who was that? I think Fuck it was, uh, I think it was Luke. <laughs> Shout out Luke. I think he had like one of his videos he posts. So like we got the brain dead, whatever these are, but you got to be brain dead to wear these. <laughs> <laughs> that should be dying. Fuck. Well, well yeah, I mean, I, I don't know, cause like, bro, that that that's nuts to me. But I wouldn't be surprised if you know you walk down No Lita and you see some motherfucker with brain dead bowling shoes on. Yuck. <laughs> Yo, but Yuck. no, and then that other that other silhouette, the BW Army. That's oh, basically yeah, the, the, the Margella replica. Margella shaking in her boots, like what the uh, fuck? Yeah, apparently, the 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 new the new kid on the block that hard the copy not, the not Margellas. Yo, this is gonna already motherfuckers take a hot dish. Yo, this is gonna be the the Adidas collab of the year. No, but all he did thing. is put his red stripe on but, that shit though. Wait, isn't but it? that shoe's always existed. The red stitch. No, the red yeah. stitch. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That shoe's always yes. existed, the BW Army. But they never uh, re-released it. Well, Ever. It, like, if you wanted to get it, you'd have you to have get to go it shipped overseas. out overseas. Yeah. 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 So I think it's cool. <laughs> it's dope, though, because it's an actual indoor training shoe. Yeah, it's a German athletic yeah. training shoe. Jesus Christ. That's what the GAT Heinz. means. Yeah, that's what GAT <laughs> means, for those who are wondering. GAT. <laughs> Well, yo, what you got on, my boy? Got the gats. <laughs> yats. I got the gats on. Yo, somebody called the other day and said that shit in my ear. I was like, mm, yo, yo, I yeah. the, you got the gat? Y'all got them gats? Like, oh, you know what it was? Man's got a hype because we dropped the Oregon, uh, uh, the dunks. We price dropped it. Uh-huh. He was like, yo, let me get those. He's like, let me check Barker real quick. Yeah, and this man said at the highest decibel, Gat! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, wait, that one right there. Yes, he was like, he was like, yo, I need that, and I was like, yeah, I was like, yo, you sure, bro? Yeah, it's like I promise you, I know what I'm doing. He's like, yeah, this <laughs> shit dropped crazy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, trust, it's gonna be the, yo, the next word the in, the, in the actual dictionary. <laughs> Cause what is it? Riz, Riz, Riz is now Riz got added to the dictionary. Nah, now it's gonna be gyat. Yeah, yeah. Or you know, should they should take off? Um, well, side note, fucking um, they need to stop this retroing bullshit. Of like, yo, the shoe came out four years ago. I got nothing else, so let me just redrop this shit. Wait, why, wait, what are you yeah. referring to? Why the fuck are Brazil's coming out next month? Cause they burnt out. Bro, what are you dunks are doing, out. bro? So for anybody that's watching who wants to doing? bring dunks, just please know, like, <laughs> please, please, <laughs> please know, like, we, we're trying our best here to, oh to be as competitive, God. but like, dunks are burnt. Bro, they're fucking cooked. Nuts. They're simmered. Yo, I, they're seasoned and peppered right now. In the past week, there's been like eight colorways, and all them shit sit. Yeah, shit's nuts. It's the next one. I mean, I think it's cool that they sit. You know, people get to... No, it's great. Again, but it's like, though, what did I say? We're back into, like, the 2015, 2016 era where shit, you can yeah. buy shit for, like, retail, like, under I w- retail. I would, I would rather them come out with new colorways mm-hmm. and let them sit than to fucking just... Nah. Just debacle a fucking... You know, you, such a good shoe. They're and just, just fucking... unloading their plans because now they really need to shift back towards, like, again, runners, GRs, all this other shit. They need to shift their focus a little bit. Right. 
Because they had their run, and they're like, okay, all right, what's next? I think they're just trying to cut the middleman out. You know, if they could keep the customer mm-hmm. in store and they could keep them com- from coming back to buy something else, whether it's a dunk or a runner or whatever the fuck it is, mm-hmm. you know, like they even have that stupid ass calm slide now. So it's like, mm-hmm. you know, mm-hmm. that's the alternative to the Yeezy slide. So they have literally every single alternative they have under the one roof. And they've been restocking like the weirdest shit. Like that fucking, that Rose Valentine's Day shit from two years ago is being, got, just got restocked last oh, week. Oh, the Air Force? Yeah. Like what the fuck? Tell you, bro. Nobody asked for that. Like <laughs> no one. Not not a no. So we're gonna re-drop the Rose Air Force. Not a near not meeting room to like for, bird. First, <laughs> of all, first of all, why are you redropping something, right? And then you're pushing an entire like eight silhouettes uh fucking Valentine's Day. Mm. No one's gonna buy that shit because they're buying yeah. this bullshit. Honestly. <laughs> what else we got? I'm waiting I'm waiting for them to start like fucking retro and grails. Fuck it. Well <laughs> was there I think supposedly no, we're, no, we're supposedly getting linens again. Oh, nah, yeah, that's dropping. Linens are dropping. Fuck. Linens are confirmed. I don't know. Yeah, I love linens, but yeah. now they're gonna be burnt. Nah, it's cool. It's alright though. Yeah. It's cool. It's, it's calm. Just, it's a good. It's a good shoe. I mean, it's a very good shoe, actually. Enough about sneakers, though. What do we think is gonna be trending this year for real? Mm. Think skinny jeans are coming back? Fuck no. No, please no. I don't know, bro. I don't even got skinny pants. Yo, I remember uh, I was actually driving. I was driving here today, and I saw a dude, like a big, big dude, skinny jeans. I was just like, damn, bro. Before, though, before, it was like, yo, the skinnier, the better. Like, <laughs> Hell got yeah. that shit on. Now it's just like. Yo, my man got those shits tatted. I'm like, damn, bro, how you how you fit into those jeans? <laughs> yeah, yo, the Fear God specials with the zipper. Oh, God. Sheesh. And the Leo wore those. scoop tee. Nah, Leo yeah. wore those. <laughs> <laughs> yo, you have a picture of those? Were you in them? Mm. Nah, don't lie. I might actually. If Leo has I'm a picture, my archive. Put it in right here. You know what's crazy? My <laughs> I think I have a Ew. picture. Or two. <laughs> nah, bro, it was an error. It was. An that error. was error. You know what's crazy? I was actually in school for fashion at that time, and I fucking um, I found out where to get the fucking like the re re zippers. Mm. So I started just making them shits. <laughs> oh, you put that shit on everything? Yeah. <laughs> <Yo>. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was such a weird time too because people that, want yo, people, that was me I, with I, the hoodies yo i i literally went from spending like two bands on jeans to fucking spending like less than 20 dollars on the fucking zippers yeah. and just doing it to whatever the yeah. fuck i want i could have reread your face if you needed it <laughs> that's fucking nuts <laughs> you know, a hoodie. that was literally yeah, such man. a weird time like that everything was, was like not, so like, was the, tight and cuffed that was the only, everything the only thing weirder was fucking sleeveless hoodies Oh my god! I think that that's still a thing. Like when you go to the gym, there's people wearing. Yeah, for the gym. Yeah, for the gym. I'm talking about like motherfuckers. Casually is, wearing it. Motherfuckers, oh, no. is, motherfuckers is layering. Yo, it's like, no it's like going to it's like going to cuffing season in a sleeveless hoodie. It's fucking nuts, bro. But like, I I can't fathom that. There's no there's no way people were doing this, bro. Nah, it was. It yo, was such a thing. Yo, bro. we should we should fuck around. Should bring it back. We should fuck around one day. Go to cuffing season. Shout out Cuffy Season, by the way. They have a show tonight at the Lux Flux. Boing! Who's who spinning tonight? My man Kim Josh Wu. Shout out yeah, to Kim Josh Wu. Shout but, out to uh, Wu Cut. One, one day we're going to pull up straight skinny jeans and mm. 2012 era. And sleeveless hoodies. And fucking stutter shades. <laughs> stutter shades. <laughs> And I'm gonna have a shirt that says "I love sluts." No, nah, you gotta get the Cookie Monster tee. Nah, the like, fucking, I love the dubstep tits, and the tits, the tits shirts. Yeah, with <laughs> fucking, I'm a Nike head with a chick blowing a fucking Nike check. Yeah, where's I'm, the the Mickey Mouse hands? The Huff weed socks. <laughs> Do you remember the the was it good? Hell yeah! Nah, Hell the yeah. Huff weed socks. Oh yeah, that was a time. <laughs> I never owned a pair. The I love boobies bracelets. What else was popular? Brian still nah, casually the, wears the, those to his the day. Pow, guys. The pow chains and the fucking, uh, the, the Goodwood chains. Oh, Oof. shout out to Yoon from Ambush for <laughs> bestowing the pow chain. Nah, oh, or yeah, the yeah. fucking uh, Don C hats or, and the Tisa hats. Uh, or Illis lanyards. Fucking the Karma Loop days. Oh, yeah. Damn. Hood by Air. Wait, Hood by Air. Was Hood by Air popping by Air? Yes. Yeah. 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 Hood by Air. Yeah. yeah. Hood by Air. Ben Trill. Ben Trill. Fucking Ben Trill hat. Hell yes. Those are good times. Yeah, yeah man. Let's watch. That was fucking gothic. We say this shit now, but fuck around. This shit's going to be popping. Fuck around. Get Q3 fucked around. You know, this year. Low key, um, <laughs> I, I wouldn't be surprised You're at some point in time. It? At some point in time, I wouldn't be surprised if that comes back. Well, Unironically. Brian's like, let me dust off these fucking. Yeah, yo. <laughs> it's like that scene in Spider Man when he opens up the suitcase and he loses like, the suit. suit. <laughs> it's like we're back in business. Oh, shit. Not right. God damn. Anything else that we have slated up? No, sir. 
We out. Another day, another topic. Hey, man. Hey, man. Episode. Whatever you guys think is going to be popular this year, Put just let us comments, know. And real. if you think one of our takes is fucking diabolical, also let us know. Yeah, at me. Yeah. <laughs> at me. At me. I'll strap Talk me. Talk shit. But once again, like, comment, subscribe. Yes, sir. And we'll see you on the next one. Peace. Appreciate y'all.